Get it while it's hot. The dude mung is 3,000. No monkey. You get this cold start going. This bike looks absolutely amazing. Sounds good. He did something to this because I promise this bike is a little bit quicker than what it was last time. This bike is kicking out some power and some torque. And you guys know I'm in love with torque. But yeah, anyway, I'm gonna check back in with y'all once we get uh once we get the festivities going. We're hungry, man. We gotta grab some vittles before we get started. I know everybody ain't up yet, but your boy gotta eat. I'll be back with y'all in just a second. Oh, it's in my pocket. <laughs> oh my goodness. That's how you know I'm excited. Get a deck of hit the key. Ooh, what up? <laughs> you did alright? Good, 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 good. Are you GP shit? Okay. Yes. <laughs> Heck yeah. Don't you do that. Oh my goodness, going to get some gas on the H2. <laughs> I'm hoping I get some more, uh, I'm supposed to get another run on this bike. Well not run, but well I mean you know what I'm trying to say. Dang, I'm supposed to be getting. I can touch the ground, oh my goodness, I cannot believe I'm on H2. <laughs> this is exciting. <laughs> this is kind of sick, I can't lie. Woo, kind of sick. But uh... I gotta get away from my fucking yell! <laughs> oh my goodness, I'm on the H2. Okay, let me get myself together. Because what I don't want to do is wreck this bad boy. Oh, I will be some kind of bad at myself if that happened. Because <laughs> I'm trying not to kick. <laughs> but I'm glad no one is around so I can yell. I'm going to go this way to the, the gas station that's a little bit further away. <laughs> No, why? Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god, did the bike do that? Hold on! Okay, I can make you do it again. <laughs> oh my goodness! Oh, I need one in my life! <laughs> holy schmole of holy crap of crapola. Uh, yeah, okay. We go the holy crap. Okay, let me get my deck of self together, guys. Holy moly! I can't believe All right, man. Woo. All right, monkeys, get your excitement together so you know what you're doing, bro. Oh, what did you do that thing? That was ridiculous. I'm oh, sorry, guys. I am so flim flam. I was not prepared to. Um, uh oh, I was not prepared to ride this thing today. All right. So while it's filling up with gas, what I will tell you guys, something that I did notice and actually honestly surprised me something I never thought if you're riding normal which I know it's gonna be hard to do but if you're riding normal it honestly feels like a normal leader bike like it really didn't feel like anything weird now I didn't get on it I didn't do anything extra but I was actually shocked to see that it actually felt normal like you watch these videos um, and there's nothing against the guy in the videos I'm not please don't think I'm saying something bad about anybody but you watch these videos and these things are just absolute savage when you're getting in the throttle and stuff like that so it's just like that's just kind of what you expect when you get on one you're like yo okay i'm expecting something to be completely savage totally you can't ride it unless you bad you that's what you expect but it's actually a it's weird it's actually a normal bike if you just do what i just did to ride them to the gas station it's actually normal so let me let you get a sound of this exhaust Brock's full uh, alien head exhaust. Sounding good. I ain't gonna hold up because they're ready to go. Sorry guys, I really got the carbon fiber wheels on the back green, carbon fiber BSTs on the front. These are actually the same wheels I have on Deadshot, except for Deadshots are just black and sports single side swing arm. Supercharged, I think this is 2016. But guys, I'm sorry this is so rushed, but let me get back to the spot because I think they're ready to leave. Y'all know how we do, we do early and gone. And you well, let's see we get. <laughs> that is just awesome. The boost is just awesome. Uh, Y'all hear me say all the time, bro. I love freaking boost. I love boost, dude. Love boost. So this has the rear brake delete. 
I just gotta get used to that not being there. <laughs> oh my gosh! I need one of these just for that. <laughs> oh my goodness, just for that that uh I don't know if this has auto blip or not, so I didn't I didn't use it, but I need one just for that uh the blow off valve. Oh my gosh. And even with the stretch, the, you can tell it's stretch because there's a you can't maneuver as tight as you normally could, but it's not it's not like you can't maneuver the bike. It's not it's not horrible. So I would definitely tell someone that's considering it or thinking about it, don't be scared to do it because it, it's still gonna run. But I ain't doing nothing crazy on nobody's bike because look, monkeys ain't ready to buy a bike before I'm ready to buy a bike. You know what I'm saying? I don't want to be paying for this bike and dig um not be able to get my bike when it's time for me to get my bike. Hey man, I can't lie, I feel like a boss with the very tools behind me. <laughs> I feel like a little brother that if somebody's messing with me, I'm like, oi, go tell my big brother, oi. <laughs> ah, heck yeah. for me. <laughs> I'm gonna take that as a win. <laughs> it's high, it's high, it's high, you know what I'm saying? I'm trying to be up on the black because I'm on the naked, but don't take group lightly. Group gonna surprise somebody. Group gonna get somebody for the bees knee. And then they got that dude Bungus mod on that motorcycle hat too. Yeah. Somebody is about to get the business. Next person that pull up, get in the business. Get it it. Go get it. See if I get him at this light. I don't want to flip this MTT in though. <laughs> I lifted it up. That front wheel came up and I was like, nah, bro, bro. <laughs> and we got to get these runs in real quick. In and out, baby. Wouldn't you know it, I get the opportunity to jump on the H2 and I have the only audio issue of the day. First hit, I do a third gear hit just to see what the boost feels like and it's daggum insane. Second hit on the bike, I do a first gear hit because I was so comfortable with the third gear hit and it is insane. Like, I don't feel like it's trying to pull my arms off, but stuff is moving so fast you literally can't focus on how fast you're going. You just literally focus on what the heck is in front of you. And the biggest takeaway I have from this H2 is that it honestly feels like a normal bike. It, it's, it's weird. Until you hit boost, it's literally a normal bike. But then again, part of this could be me. Uh, I told y'all I'm a Kawa guy at heart. I feel at home on Kawasaki. And I honestly was not as scared as I thought I was going to be. I thought I was going to be terrified. But honestly, I wasn't scared at all. All right. It looks like we had our first casualty today. Uh, seems like a H2 uh, did a hit, caught traction immediately. 12 o'clock wheelie, it came down hard, busted the oil pan. I'm not for sure who it was. Um, so we have to reconvene somewhere else. <laughs> I didn't know they was running. Woo! I did not know they was running. Holy crap, that scared the pajamas out of me. I don't know. 
weather look like it's starting to creep in. That's pretty dope. At 30,000 to pop, 28, you know, some deals people get. Man, that's pretty damn dope. Half mile officially marked off. They about to get that shot at, Mark. Yeah, man, getting a 30,000 mile service and they down the tech, so it's just the, there's only one tech working back there right now, so they just backed up. So I'm gonna get them back after this meet, and I'm just like, oh, dang, man, dang, dang, dang. Envy King, you don't get your big butt out the way. Guess I'll just catch the finish line footage since old Jolly Green Giant's in the way. Hey man, clean victory, bro. Okay. <laughs> clean victory. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they got it on video. He came into my life almost hit me. Oh. He went up in a wheelie. Yeah. It, it drifted. Wow. Woo. But I, I, I still congratulate him after all that. Right, yeah, yeah. I was wondering what happened. I was like, yo, that person was a good run now. And I was like, oh, uh, okay. That would explain it. Y'all don't know, no. The 636 was my first Kawasaki. I had one in all black. Um, this is my first introduction to Kawasaki and I've been loving Kawasaki ever since. Even though I'm a Ducati guy now, but I love Ka That is insane, bro. These bikes are loud. I mean, it can't sound like that when I come by on this side. It just, it can't be that loud. I know it's loud, but it ain't that loud. All right, dude, and do that. That is a wrap. Uh, cops have officially broken up the spot. Uh, sorry, I cut this video short, bro. It's just, hey, man, I ain't about that life. <laughs> but I appreciate y'all rocking with your boy. You know what it is. One shot, just shot. Two monkeys. Definitely be sure to go check out some of these other YouTubers. Uh, 650 Eva have a video up. Joe STI have a video up. Joe Steve have a video up. And then you see the sky. This weather is about to turn really bad. I'm just, yo, it ain't worth it, bro. I'm just going and call it a day. Like, uh, having dedicated race spot, honestly, that spot up north in Detroit was literally the best spot for racing, man. I mean, I know that's a far way to travel to do racing, but there's almost no better spot for racing that I've seen, like dedicated racing. Other than that, you almost need to, uh, you almost need to stick and move with doing runs, man. Stick, move, stick, move. Start early and be done. And, and go about your business, you know, you know what I mean? So be like, at the crack of daylight, start early, bap, 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 bap. And before, before 11, noon, dude, you should have all your runs in.
like it. Thank you for watching, dudes. No market.